my name is Brianna Beverly and you're watching Titan Weekly. This week we'll be highlighting some fresh entertainment and CSUF news. Let's get started. Oh sorry, I was posting my first fleet. Have you heard about it? It's Twitter's newest update that rolled out last week, allowing users to post stories that vanish within 24 hours. This popular feature was introduced by Snapchat in 2013 and since has been added to almost every possible social media outlet you can think of, even LinkedIn. Although users aren't able to refleet or see other public replies, users can react or respond to posts through direct messages. Twitter is reportedly also working on expanding voice tweets and testing audio in direct messages in Brazil. However, the update does not stop there. Twitter is set to release audio spaces by the end of the year. This feature will allow for a live audio space where multiple people will be able to communicate and discuss a topic. While these updates are very exciting, Twitter can give us all of this but not an edit button? Calling all baking novices, it's your time to shine. Pepsi is reportedly offering a limited edition apple pie flavored soda. Now, before you get too excited, this new release can't be found in stores. You can only win it in a contest. Pepsi is asking people to upload pictures or videos of their worst baking fail on TikTok or Twitter with the hashtag Pepsi Apple Pie Challenge. The first 1,500 entries are eligible to win from which Pepsi will vote on their favorites. All right, who doesn't know how to bake and wants to help me make a pumpkin pie? CSUF Health Services is offering free COVID testing for all symptomatic or exposed students. For more information, contact the Health Services Center on campus. If you are exposed or think you have been exposed, there is a self-reporting form you can fill out to let the university know. Let's continue to take care of one another so we can get back together on campus very soon. Bachelor Home Alone. Now you can be part of ABC's The Bachelor, well, at least you can pretend you are part of it. The mansion used in the TV show is up for rent on Airbnb for $6,000 a night. You can have access to seven bedrooms, eight and a half baths, a pool, and two jacuzzis. Now, I don't know about you, but all I want for Christmas is a weekend getaway in Malibu in this mansion. Not feeling The Bachelor though? No worries. For those who want to be more home alone this holiday season, there is also an Airbnb for you. A Dallas resident has decked the halls with a throwback to the 90s classic holiday hit, Home Alone, also available on Airbnb through the holidays. Be careful though, the rental reportedly comes with Kevin's booby traps scattered around the house. Whether you want to get away in paradise or a 90s throwback, there is a vacation spot for you. For our last story, here's one candle you won't want to smell. A candle company in the United Kingdom entitled Flaming Crap has capitalized on overall widespread distaste of this year by making a new candle called the 2020 scent. This candle will take sniffers on a journey through four scented layers, including hand sanitizer, banana bread, aftershave, and DIY projects. The company says that the scents don't complement each other, which is supposed to mimic how off kilter this year has been. Are you down to try this or would you rather forget 2020 even happened? Let us know in the comments down below. Well guys, that's all the time we have for today. Tune in next time for some more fresh entertainment and CSCF news. Like always, I'm Brianna Beverly and I'll see you guys next week. Bye.